This is James at photographybyjet.com and today we're going to talk about cropping photos before you email them to friends. Um, a lot of times um, your friend isn't ever going to print those pictures that you send them and emailing a large file or uh, just isn't uh, a good use of your time or their time when they're waiting for it to download. So we'll just show you how to get those sizes down real quick. Um, this particular file that we're looking at is in original JPEG form is 8 megabytes and on screen it's actually 35 megabytes. A really huge file, definitely not something that, you're gonna, that your friend's going to want you to email. So we're working in Photoshop Elements. Uh, we'll work just like this in Photoshop too if you have it and a lot of other image editing software will be the same. And what you need to do is click the crop tool right here. And I'll move that out of our way. And what we're going to do is just Pick a nice size to work with up here, uh, maybe 5 by 7 kind of a nice size print to look at. I'm going to set the resolution to 72 because it's just for looking at on a screen, not for, um, not for printing or anything like that. And all you have to do then is just drag the box around the area that you want, want to uh, crop. And you can move that box around a little bit if you want to adjust it. make it just a little bit bigger here. And when you're satisfied with what you have, uh, just just double click in the middle and your, your image is now sized and cropped. And then just go to File and Save for Web. And this brings up uh, Photoshop Elements Save for Web feature. And what we can do is just uh, adjust the compression under the quality setting and that's right here. Now this image it doesn't really show a whole lot of difference as we go up or down. Um, most images you're probably going to want to keep it around 50 or 60 and before you start seeing too much uh, loss of quality in your picture. And when you think you've got it to a good setting for your image, you can just click OK. It'll ask you to save it. You usually want to give it a different name. This is fine for me. And you're done. Thank you.